Hi, my name is Pranam Mehta. I'm the academic head of Clad Tutor Bangalore. Now let's come to the highlight of the day. The Clad is finally done and uh, it looks very good that, you know, in this testing time, a Clad like examination has been conducted and which basically is going to give uh, a student a you know, good opening to look forward to the next academic cycle and other aspect. Okay, so it is very, very important that in this testing time an examination is being conducted. Now, looking at the paper, looking at the paper, uh, I will not be taking much of your time to give you a, a brief, you know, analysis of uh, this uh, CLAT 21. Uh, perfectly neatly done. I was there in NLS Bangalore Center uh, taking the test and very neatly done all, all protocols being followed. I, and I was very surprised to see a doctor also visiting the, you know, the room and, and checking that the mask were there in place and all those things. So very nicely uh, conducted. I congratulate uh, CLAT Consortium to do this uh, examination so well and hope all of you have done well with, with proportionate to your preparation level. Fine. Now look at the sections. If you look at English, English was pretty, uh, pretty much uh, uh, a, a doable section and easy, I will say. And rather, there was a poem also and very direct questions, couple of vocabulary oriented things. So not much of challenge to be done. Anyone uh, having a good reading habit could have done well in this. So an easy section. Any anywhere, you know, if you have done twenty five plus of attempt, some of the options were very close in terms of taking a call on that because of the complexity of the passage because so much of reading is required. So if you have done at the start, it's good. But if you have done in between the reading comprehension, then it becomes slightly complex. So any any any, any attempt between 25 plus is a good attempt. If you are there at 23 also, I will suggest it's a, it's a good attempt. If your accuracy is good enough, okay? Logical reasoning, again, you know, if you look at this section, I figure out that to be medium, the reason behind the amount of reading which was supposed to be done and the options were also slightly lengthier to understand and couple of options are also very close. Okay, so that way I could realize that. And one more thing, which was very uh, sad to see that, you know, so many passages driven on COVID. I think, you know, somewhere, somewhere the paper setter have been very skewed towards one topic, which, which I realized that, you know, that has taken, you know, you, 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 you address a topic from North, then you address the topic from South, then you address from the North. So that was what the structure of this was. So a lot of reading was involved in the logical reasoning. So I think anywhere, if you have done 23 plus, I will suggest you perfectly good. 20 plus also is, is fine enough to look forward. Okay. The beauty of this paper was maths, okay? The quantitative technique, you could have asked all the questions. There was one data error, but I think the data error was not impacting the, out of the five questions, four question, it was not impacting in one of the question, it had an impact. So, so I can tell you that any any decent uh, preparation could have given you 14 marks out of 15. So, so you can't get an easy paper, uh, uh, you know, maths paper in a CLAT like examination like this, okay? Legal reasoning, again, you know, good amount. Again, there is a shift also. Fine. So this is very interesting to look at. Previous, that means if you look at the last 10 to 15 years, how the CLAT has been conducting, they have been conducting by taking the legal term. So they used to, you know, define you what is contract and then they used to ask you a uh, question based on that. So they have gone back to the same structure. If you look at, you know, they have they have started picking up the definition of of res judicata or 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 some of the section one twenty four something like this. So so they have started getting into that. So now they are not depending on the news article and framing the questions from there. So this is slightly interesting shift which you can see in the CLAT examination. Okay, so if you look at the paper was 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 difficult to read. Okay, but the questions were pretty much straightforward. If you if you know what is uh, what, what is basically a res judicata means or what section stands for. So all contract, basic contract type of things, contract being done in geography A and geography B, where the, uh, in case of dispute, where you need to go and fight. So, so all fundamentals were tested. So, so it was basically testing your reading ability. Okay. How, how well you are able to concentrate with the question and able to solve that. Okay. So it is not traditionally based on what, what has been, uh, you know, done last year. So this is one shift definitely which you can observe on this paper. Okay. General knowledge, if you look at, I consider this as, as a difficult section. Reason behind this comes out to be, there comes out to be good portion of the paper has been very static. You know, 1994 question, 1994 being tested, then 2019 being tested, 
so somehow i was not very happy to look at the paper where you know you are going so backward and and at the same time focusing on some of the questions which were or or something you know 2019 you are then in 2021 so a question based on 2021 will make better sense for a student then asking for 2019 again you know i i might be also wrong in my interpretation reason we and until as we we get into the detail of that okay so but but again if if framing of the question somewhere you know slightly outdated i will consider that overall paper if you ask me a moderate paper i will not consider this as easy paper i will consider this as a moderate paper because you can very easily see there are two sections logical reasoning and legal reasoning testing and gk being slightly not on the on the straight line okay so this gives you you a rough point that uh, if if a, if you just do the analysis in legal, uh, legal reasoning if you are if you are there with 30 plus attempt or 32 plus of attempt it's a very good attempt to look forward to general knowledge i could see that there were 19 exactly question which are very straight that means you could i i am assuming if you are a serious clat candidate you should have got those 19 questions okay that means there were very straight forward asking for a cabinet minister uh, unhrc full form and other things so these were very straight forward questions so 19 i could very easily pick out so if you have done 18 plus also that's good enough looking at overall you know if you have done an attempt of 115 to 120 and you carry an accuracy of 80% i think you are there in the safe boat okay whatever is your dream college you can make it okay a small analysis based on the last year's cut off and just trying to compare i think you know is the top 3 in nlus can anyone can anyone with the 95 plus has a chance to you know make it to the top 3 nlus okay and if you ask me specifically where the nls bangalore will be standing somewhere about 98 99 is a good good score for for nls bangalore like of college okay and at the same time state reservation coming into picture the dynamics might change but plus minus one or two you can take it over there okay that is what this comes out to me those who have done well congratulation to you all your hard work has come into picture those who could not perform don't get into this analysis by us this is all are based on our knowledge system okay at the same time thing these are all predicted values okay don't get disheartened in case if you if you are not into these marks wait for the final scores to come and then bang on it okay at the same time don't do lot of analysis what you see in the different different platforms being analysis being done and other things don't get into those uh, uh, things and don't waste your time get into your next examination which is coming up alet and start revising your gk because again those 35 questions will come out to be very important in terms of making the difference because in next 5 to 6 days you can't prepare all those other four sections so definitely you can make a difference towards the general knowledge do that and all the best for your coming examination in case if you have anything further to it you can connect uh, with us on the telegram channel or you can also mail us at the hello hello@clattutor.com thank you so much all the best for your coming examination